We are at Hard Schlock Stadium, home of the Crack Engine, Diami, Florida. A city where the temperature is over 100 and the IQ is in the low teens, <laughs> at best. Then don't poke fun at the fans. They're loyal. Therapists call it delusional. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Snuffalo Thrills battle. The Diami Krakens. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> it's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitro here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all you can eat horseship buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. And it's first and ten. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Second down, the size of Brick Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Oh, he just got crushed! And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! set up the offense just catch it run it back and don't die and it's first and ten and this guy is on fuego does he look like he's a rip the defenders that's a first down and it's first and ten oh sure now he catches it i had this guy on my fantasy team last week I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. 
see if they can get something going here. First down and nine. That's a six-yard gain. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, that worm grabbed him by the head and didn't let go. Talking a lot of crap right now. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a brutal hit! Second down and five. really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brains ran with a ball and didn't fall out. little chip shot here extra point but this guy could blow it straight through the uprights when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay First and ten. Second down in a very lot. One, not two. be washing bloody footprints off the defense's jerseys after a run like that. And this game is up for grabs. Third and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And a hard run there picks up the first down.
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot eight. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Hey man, nobody can touch me with that ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Huh? Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. Whoa. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and long. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third down and the punter is warming up. will give them a first down. I don't know if they're hitting. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. Third down in the QB, and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot. Now the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> one yard on that pass. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And they brought him to a dead stop, literally. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Now 
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Oh, hell with all son of them. Second down and more than the QB would like. Well, fee, fi, fo, fum. I and that's it. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. He scores! With kickers, you never know. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. It's about a three-yard pickup. They stop the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. One, three. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. He really won. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. The quarterback burns his last time out. He can't stop the clock anymore. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's magic stupsing time. That's why the girls... Yeah. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Now, this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Give me more, more, more. Give me more. 
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And he's running like a moose right now. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. A lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. No, well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Third down and forever. The QB looks angry at his offensive line, and I can't blame him. underrated position in a fake punt if you can't trust a punter who can you trust you ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim nope well i have fun they might consider calling a kill the ref play just saying yeah. and they'll line up for the punt it's a jailbreak and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref oh crowd's loving it They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one.
And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. It's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Second down and six. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Missed a beat for Bray Graham and the ball didn't fall down. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. I like this. They're going for two. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just turned ginormous. Look out! And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. Second down and ten. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. That run is good for ten yards. Second down and in inches. First and ten. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the kettle now. You know what happened? Second down and a lot. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and long. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. 
Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, man. You know, they train those things to eat only visiting players, but when they're hungry, they'll eat anything. Yeah, sometimes I eat my toenails. And it's first and ten. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap! And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hey. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Hey. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a Sonic Blast dirty trick. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. Perfect pass and the score! Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick. But not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Luke Warren. That's a bad kick, and it's going to cost them some yards. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. This guy's a brick shithouse. And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And that'll bring up second and one. Hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. 
straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe for the headache. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Oh, no, it's a sticky ball dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? You no, know, my friend. I didn't. I love this job. It's a butterjerk time. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot, hot one, hot. And he just slipped away like, and the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third down and the punter is warming up. And that's a pick. And now the Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean when they're not young. And it's first and ten. No, oh, it's a punishing hit. Second down and five. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. A nice run there for eight yards. Third down and six. And the two-minute warning sounds. They'll have to regroup during this timeout. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. No one was interested in that incomplete pass. Man, not a ball's feelings are hype. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. That 
that's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and kill. And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly in the open field bricks the defense is leaving the team with just one timeout, so they better bring the ball back gift wrapped is it time for a ribbon or a ball grim maybe if they use their last timeout. hot one hot two hot. and he zips that one in there for a touchdown Seriously, man, you think you'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And they just smacked that one back in his face. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And he held on to that one for a first down. And, it's, and that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of death's constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them time out to stop our own clock. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was... Diamond Krakens lose at home. And that stings worse than a jellyfish in your swim trunks. Oh, I love peanut butter and jellyfish sandwiches, Grim. It was close for a while, but in the end, it was just too much for them, and they couldn't get it done. Sounds like your wedding night, doesn't it? Hey, they got pills for that. You know that commercial where they show a mummy getting a boner? What the hell are you talking about, Bricks? I don't know. I get confused often. I'm on a lot of painkillers. Well, moving right along, let's hear what the MVP has to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for...